We may have found the key to anti-aging, or should I say, healthy aging. Let's see what research can tell us. Skeletal muscle is highly affected by the aging process. Age-induced loss of skeletal muscle has been related to mobility impairments and increased risk of falls and physical frailty. Aging is also associated with a decline in muscle metabolism, as exemplified by a decrease in insulin sensitivity, metabolic inflexibility, increased oxidative stress and mitochondrial dysfunction. Understanding and targeting the aging process itself, rather than treating symptoms, may be the most effective strategy to prevent aging-related health decline. Regular exercise training has been shown to protect against aging-induced deterioration of muscle health. Dutch researchers recently performed a study about aging and muscle function. They examined an essential substance in our cells called NAD+. Let's dig a little deeper. The researchers found a significant age-related decline in NAD+. These changes suggest an age-related change in skeletal muscle metabolism. When comparing the muscle tissue of old and young adults, most metabolic changes that occur with age can be reversed with regular exercise training. The highly active older adults group possessed levels of NAD+, comparable to those found in young adults. High levels of NAD plus are directly correlated with mitochondrial function and muscle health. Through muscle biopsies, they revealed many NAD plus related interactions. They found various NAD plus metabolites to be strongly linked to healthy muscle aging. Numerous preclinical studies have indicated NAD plus depletion as the primary cause of disease and disability during aging. Increasing NAD plus in animal models improved, among other things, muscle recovery, endurance capacity, mitochondrial function, oxidative metabolism, insulin sensitivity, and increased lifespan. In line with these preclinical studies, this NAD plus related metabolite network supports that NAD plus abundance is indeed an indicator of muscle health in aging humans. Just to be clear, NAD plus is a completely natural body substance occurring in our cells. Research about NAD plus in humans is still very early, and claims about anti-aging effects by supplementing with NAD plus should be taken with a grain of salt. Luckily, we now have the knowledge to give our NAD plus levels a natural boost through exercise. If you enjoyed this episode, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you next week again for a new episode. Until then, I'm out. And I think it's time for you to grow old and stay strong.